Okay, anyway, I want to show you what it looks like as it's evaporating. Um, I'm not sure if the light's real good. I'll pick it up and hold it for you. There you go. Well, you can see how quickly this stuff evaporates on its own. Um, I'll have to look at the video when I'm done making this to see what time we started. But uh, we're just a couple minutes away from having a finished product here. I'll be right back in the picture. This, by the way, is a vacuum pump that I uh, picked up at Harbor Freight. I need this tilted down more. Anyway, that's a vacuum pump that I picked up from a friend of mine and uh, put snugly on my small cake pan. As soon as I get this evaporated down to a thick gel, we will uh, pull a vacuum on it and then I will see if I can't go find a couple people that would like to sample DHO for the first time. This is called DHO, not BHO, because it's dimethyl ether honey oil. The cleanest tasting, um, I'd like to say it tastes exactly like the plant, but you concentrate the hell out of everything so it kind of changes the taste, but it leaves with an excellent flavor. Uh, Anyway, you can pick up the vacuum pump at Harbor Freight for a little over $100. And, as you can see, this stuff is evaporating quickly away. I'm not sure how long it's been, but I'm thinking it's relatively close to five minutes. And I do believe we're only a minute or two away from producing the good solid wax that you can enjoy with your friends you know for a fact that it's quality because you used your weed you used a totally organic completely a complete totally organic solvent with a complete evaporation point butane has no such animal and uh it's full of heavy metals it's from a gasoline deposit this product was designed specifically we're taking marijuana and taking all of the good things out of it all the way. So we're going to, uh, we're down to just about, we're like that right now. If it doesn't want to flow, I'll walk over here and give you guys a shot. Anyway, this is what it's doing right now, just from being sitting in the warm water. It's purging itself on its own. Here in a couple minutes, I'll go set it into the vacuum, put the vacuum pump on it. But as you can see, within just a few minutes of time, this thing is kicking ass. Okay. And look at the color. It's drying just the prettiest gold. Can you see that? That's beautiful. Alright, now I'm going to put it on the vacuum pump. And uh, I'll pull about 25 pounds of vacuum. And we will watch this turn into the most prettiest finished product with a great smooth taste. And you can make it from any part of the plant you'd like. You can use the stems. You don't get a whole lot of of uh, quality, quantity, but you get the, it's the, the leaves, all the leaves have the same quality of THC that the bud does, just in smaller amounts. There we go, we're pulling the vacuum on it. Now let that stuff bubble. Oh yeah. Alright, we're at about 
45 pound vacuum. And about 27. 26 to 27 pounds of vacuum. I'm going to lock it down right there and uh, we'll let it set for a minute. We'll pop the top and you can examine what I've created here. In Ten minutes. So, let's not five minute dabs, it's ten minute dabs. Much cleaner. Uh, it's been purged. It doesn't have to be. I don't generally purge. I didn't until I got this. Um, it speeds the process up by several hours. And, uh, by Joe, I do believe we're done. We could be smoking this right now. So, I'll drop the vacuum. We will remove this from the water. And uh, I want to be real careful because I don't want to break anything. been removed and look at that product beautiful gold um, and smells like marijuana it's beautiful it's gold and it smells just like marijuana not like any type of chemical um, I've had it tested. There's no residuals left in it. There's no uh, heavy metals at all. There never were. There never will be. It's created from a vapor. Goes back into a vapor. Doesn't harm our planet, our future, our kids. Does not contaminate your medicine or your recreational concentrates. Um, I'm playing with it, finding new things to do all the time. If you want to stay Check me out, give me a call. I'll tell you what I've found out, figured out so far. This works open air blasting. It also works in a closed loop system. So, if you're doing closed loop, there's a couple gaskets that need to be changed out. Get back with me and I'll help you find out which ones they are. Anyway, thank you for paying attention for a few minutes and we'll find some people to help me smoke this. Thank you very much. DNA. Appreciate your viewing. Have a good day.